Good evening, everyone. How is everyone doing on this fine, fine Monday night? Are you guys doing good? You guys doing great? You guys doing synonyms for good? If you're not having a magnificent day, I hope I can make your day just a tiny bit better. And if you're having a good day, I still hope I can make your day better. I'm gonna make it the best day ever. You guys are probably wondering what we are playing today. And what we are playing today, as always, is located in the middle of the screen. And it is something that I haven't done in a very, very, very long time. But in the middle of the screen is the return of an old fan favorite. The scarier rrr folder. Yeah, I need to think of better names. I'm starting to run out of variations of the name. You guys are also wondering, what have I got on my hair right now? Well, this right here is the Just Kidding Star. This is to let the feds know, or if anyone watching this video is part of MI6, that anything that I say in this video is a joke. Any coincidental references to current world affairs is what it is. A coincidence. <laughs> Nothing that I say should be taken seriously in the court of law. Now, the second question is, why is the chat missing? It's because I kidnapped every single one of them. I'm only joking. I didn't kidnap them. <laughs> Look, I'm, I'm just kidding. <laughs> but yeah, no, I decided for the first recording of 2023. Yes, 2023. Time is going faster than you could ever imagine. Time is moving and you are not. You should start moving. Time will catch up to everyone, including me, including the person watching this. You are aging right now. <laughs> anyway, it's a new year and I haven't played through the scary Aurora folder in a very long time. The biggest and most important reason is because going through Itch.io is a pain. It's a pain with a capital P A E I G H. N E pain, but I think the start of the year should signal some changes for my fortune when it comes to finding random horror games. So if you want more random horror games from me, leave a like down below and comment. I rarely ask for this at the start of the video, but I need to know the demand to bring back the scary year folder. Let's go for 4,562 likes. Okay. Anyway, for the first of the year. Without further uh, do let's go open the scarier rur folder rur, rur, and see what games we have to play today. All right, editor, track the mouse. As you can see, we only have two random horror games today, as opposed to the regular four that I tend to go for. The first game on our list is Danny's House. I ain't living here! Get that unity counter on the screen right now, editor. We're gonna... Who the hell are you? <laughs> Welcome, everyone, to Danny's House. Danny's House looks shit, if I'm going to be honest. I do like how the menu is minimalistic and that pattern on the wall actually is the same pattern in my own wall. Are you telling me that Danny is in my house? That would be a bit unfortunate. Anyway, stop peeking. You have been hired by your neighbor, Mary. Mary? To watch her dog Ginger late one night during a thunderstorm. That's it. That's all we're getting. Well, I promise I won't let Mary down. Let's begin the game. Hello. Oh, hi. Hi, Ginger. Whoa, look at you. Look at you. God damn. <laughs> All right, anyway, what are you talking about? Identify a safe place in your home for you and your pets to wait out the storm. Oh, it's something about the storm. Okay, anyway. All right, let me see the shadow. Wait, do we have a body? We have a... Oh, my God. What are we... <laughs> All right, the dish is away, and there seems to be a... That is very, very ominous. I don't like that. All right, let's see. What are we supposed to do? Cue to examine. Thank you again for agreeing to watch Ginger tonight. She really seems to hate bad weather, so I'm not too sure how she'll react to the storm later. I hope she doesn't give you too much trouble. P.S. I had to leave in a rush earlier, so there are some dishes in the kitchen I didn't have time to put away. If you clean up a little for me, I'll pay you extra. Thanks again, and please make yourself at home. Mary. I will do you proud. I will... Yeah. Can we carry all of these? Oh, hang on. You whining? 
Hi! I, I, I woke you up. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm sorry, sorry. I shouldn't have done that. I shouldn't have done that. I'm sorry! Such as Griffin, Girl, Rudder, and Fulton Counties for serial killer Danny Decker after his escape from the Maple County Penitentiary two weeks ago. Oh! Number 17. Oh, that's not armed. armed? Should he be approached? Uh, if you think you have spotted Danny Decker, you are advised to not acknowledge him in any way and to call law enforcement immediately. Mayor Bradley has again stated that the public should remain cautious, but also I just got scared by my own shadow. Oh God, I've lost my mojo. I don't normally get got by that. Oh, you have to drag. Oh no. Oh no, this is obviously bait for a jump scare. You just go, you slowly open the door, and then he's just dead, just like, Ugh! oh, someone's calling. Who's calling? Hey, it's Hello? Me, Harry. I just saw the news, and it looks like the weather's going to get a little worse over there tonight than we thought. Okay. Would you mind letting Ginger out in the backyard one more time, really quick, before the storm starts? Stay safe tonight. I doubt you'll lose power, but just in case you do, there is a key in my bedroom that goes to the breaker box downstairs. Thanks of again. course. Of why do we just have, okay, why did that look like a cross between Michael Jackson and Vladimir Putin? And why is this so dark? Oh, there he goes. Yeah, yeah. Oh, look how much fun Jinder is. I can't go outside. Wait, hang on. What are you doing? What are you doing? You digging? What are you digging? Treasure? A body? For me? No idea. All right, well, I'm just gonna bing chill then. Someone's calling again? All right, what do you want now? Mary, your voice is really, really robotic. I really like your inflection. Your inflection's pretty cool. All right, who's calling? The Bluetooth device is connected successfully. I cannot carry more than one. Did you leave the door open? I... Th no, I didn't leave the door open! Wait! What's it referring to? What's this in reference to? You mean this door? Oh! Oh, oh no! Is, is Danny inside? Why is he not letting me pick it up? Is that an angle I meant to pick it up at? I can't escape! I put the- <sighs> Alright. Alright. The game's not broken. I'm just really, really stupid. They're making me do this one by one just to catch me out, right? I, this is thunder. It's gonna be thunder. All the power's gonna go out. I know your tricks. I know your tricks, you pesky little horror game, you. I know you're going to turn off all the lights. Why else would you mention the breaker room? Like, I'm just waiting for it. I'm bracing for it. I'm hard. I'm really, really hard right now. I know when it's gonna happen. And I prepared for it. I don't know where I was going to go with that bit, but all I'm going to say is that I know it's coming. Or Danny Decker has been narrowed down to the immediate Thurl County area. Danny is highly special. There it is! I knew it! I knew it! Yeah, that's right. Hi, why are you barking in there? Oh no. Where did Ginger go? Maybe Ginger's a figment of our imagination. Maybe, maybe Ginger's the friends we made along the way. Oh wait, we need a key to the, I'm, I don't trust that. Find the key to the breaker box. Well, it's a good thing I know where that is. Why is there a wheelchair here? Why is there, whoa, God, all right, fair, fair enough. All right, the way that breaker is, I'm, I'm 99% sure there's gonna be something behind me when I flip that breaker. So I'm going to, you know what? Oh, you can't, you can't, you can't, you can't trick me. I'm gonna moonwalk it. Aha, yeah, that's right. Yeah, I know, I know your tricks. Watch this. I knew it! I knew it! What was that? He had a big mouth. Find Ginger and do I have to find Ginger and leave? Well, Danny's in our house, I think. Or maybe this is Danny's house. Oh, I hear I hear Ginger. It sounds like she's in the bedroom. Oh, there's Danny. Oh. Hi. Oh, is he just gonna walk? Alright, I guess I'm just gonna follow him. <laughs> I think we just gotta be stealthy now. <laughs> Alright. It sounds like she's in the bedroom. Oh well, let's go get Ginger. Oh, wow. 
How convenient. It sounds like she's in the whole club. This is, this sounds like a big debate. I don't buy it one bit. Now, where's, where's Danny? Um, does, does Danny, Danny have that bunda? Does, Dan, does Danny have the bunda? <laughs> oh, I hear you barking, Ginger. I'm just trying to focus on, on where, where my man, my man Danny is. Hi. Oh, look at that. Look at him. Oh, look at him. Oh, look at him. Oh my God. He faced through that wall. Is he too tall for this corridor? God, look at the way he's walking. He's, he's, he's going around. He's on, he's on the circuit. Oh shit. That means, oh, that means I need to go. Right, let me go find. All right. Nope. That is locked. God damn it. I completely forgot. So this is, so the jump scare sends you back here. So this is where the bulk of the game's going to be. I get it now. I don't have time for this. Oh, hi. Whoa, whoa. What are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> He's just flailing. <laughs> Does this count as me breaking a game? Editor, do you want to count that as breaking the game? Should we have a counter this year on how many games I break? Does this count as the first one? I think that counts as the first one, editor. I want you to put the timer at the top of the screen on the top right corner. Do it or you're fired. Now that he's just running, why, why does he look why does he look like he's running to get a PS5 in, in 2020? <laughs> editor, let's get a plug-in for gamers up on the screen right now. 10% use code duck or code T9 to get 10% off your gamer subs! Right, that's the bunda. That was the bunda. It sounds like she's in the bathroom. Does it now? This is just a debate. I think it's just Danny making those noises. I think Danny just has that ability. It sounds like she's in the dining room. Does it now? Does it now? All right, this angle, from this angle, we can see the bunda. Yes. Yes. It's obviously not in the dining room. Wait, where's Danny? Why has Danny disappeared? Oh, oh, how convenient. What if it just turns out that Ginger's been in the bedroom this entire time? Watch, I'm gonna go into the living room right now. She's in here somewhere. Oh! Oh, he was making those noises! Ginger was in the bedroom! Ah! Oh, I made it! Find a way out. Oh! How are we gonna find a way out? Am I trapped here? Wait! Hang on. We can go out here. Storm continues throughout Girl County, so does the search for Danny Decker. We are now receiving a call from Redacted. That's I made it! I did it! My survival skills unrivaled. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it! So yeah, that was Danny's house. What would I rate Danny's house out of 10? It felt like it was a bit... I I know it might have been the it might have been an early attempt, but if the AI is improved and it's made more unpredictable, this game would be 10 times scarier because uh, once you realize that all the AI does is just loop around and it actually doesn't really see you and you also it also loses you, then the scare factor is not there. But apart from that, pretty decent game. Six out of 10, also known as... And so you know what, you do the, you do the alternate score out of 10. Put it on the screen right now. Okay, that was Danny's house. On to our next game. Yeah, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna bash my hand on the desk anymore. That was that's that's old school. Our second and final game of today is called Driving Home. Are we driving home to Danny's house by any chance? This is drivinghome.exe. I also don't know about this game, but I was told it's alright. So I'm going to take it with open arms and open drivinghome.exe. Let's begin. Before I open the game, actually, one thing I did want to mention is that there should be more avenue for car-related horror games, like a demon car after you or something, and you have to be really good at driving. Imagine, like, Trackmania, but horror. That'd be scary as hell, because you'd be like, oh, this is just a jolly little game. I'm just driving all around. Oh, no, there's a deer on the road. Better swerve. And then you swerve and then there's children playing in a field and then the car rolls over them and then now they're haunting the forest. That's a sick game idea, isn't it? I'm telling you, someone needs to get on it. And that is the second game with the Unity Counter. Editor, can we get a Unity Counter on the screen right now? We are on two. Two, okay? Two. Welcome to Driving Home version 1.01. .01. As you can already tell by the aesthetic of the menu, this is a VCR based horror game. I don't see the PS1 graphics, but I certainly see the VCR nature of the game. 
It was a Thursday, November the 16th. I was working late. I drove home. Okay. Well, we're driving. Oh, we're driving. All right, let's go. Oh, wait, hang on. We're driving on the wrong side. Oh. Anyway, I had that thought. What if I just careered onto oncoming traffic? Why are we flickering? Is that something I should be worried about? Uh-oh. No. No. Not in the middle of the road. Someone called it AA or uh, 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 something. I don't know the car insurance direct line. We got to we got to fix this. Oh, is this a whip? I tried using my phone, but I didn't get any signal. <laughs> Wait, of course you already get the signal. Why would you get the signal? I decided to follow the road until I find a gas station or something. American moment. As in, come on. They're, they're realistically, if you're in the UK, you'd see a Shell or a Texaco or an Esso. I don't see any gas station. I don't see anything of the sort. Maybe an Esso. That's a... Mm, no. Mm. Okay, maybe I'll go investigate. I'll go investigate. The hell is this? I saw a house. I decided to go there and ask for help. I didn't check the license plate. Ed editor, is this the same as our car down there? All right, let's knock on the door. I knocked on the door, but no one answered. Okay, okay, stop. Stop right there. Stop right there. One pet peeve against this game. Why is everything being written out? We can see what you are doing. It's going to say I knocked to get. All right, well... Uh, looks like we're not gonna get any anything there. I saw a back door which was open. Really weird. Anyway, so we're gonna go into this house that we have no business in, with a back door that's open and a front door that's locked. We're breaking in. We're gonna get punished by the police. I'm in. I'm envisioning. We're just gonna get shot by 15 policemen the second we walk in this house. Okay. The garage door was locked. I needed to find the key. Because of course we needed to find the key. Uh, key? I just realized something. If the garage door is locked and there's a key, what is? what are the odds there's going to be some... There, there's going to be some <clears throat> fuck shit behind that door. I mean, I, I feel like we've kind of gotten through all of our business here. There's no telephone here. So we should, in theory... Go. Imagine it's the out only. Just like, goes through there. Anyway, we've got the garage door key. God, the fact that it's locked and you have to do it, it just makes me queasy. I thought there was going to be a jump scare second I opened this door. I unlocked the garage door. I gently opened the door. Say or it. My heart sank after I opened the... <laughs> Damn, oh my God, it actually is scran. <laughs> I was gonna, I was gonna make a quip about whether these were scrannable, but apparently, okay. Well, there's nothing there. Let's just leave. Let's just leave. There's no telephone here. I'm going. Oh wait, hang on. No, I, I lied. I'm not going. There's, there's some fuel. There's some fuel. What are the odds that we can suddenly run? All right, let's pick it up. I took the fuel tank and decided to leave as fast as possible. Well, you don't need to tell me twice. This man is broadcasting his thoughts so damn loud. I started running to my car like a madman. This doesn't really seem like running to your car like a madman. I'm not even going to lie. You're really, really slow. I swear it felt like something was following me. Is something following you? Once I get to the safety of my car, I'll refuel it and then drive away. Wait, so all of a sudden you're talking in the uh, the present tense or the future tense when you were on the past tense. I thought you were recalling something. Why did you suddenly switch tenses? Are you implying that something's going to happen to you once you get in the car? Hmm? Hmm? Yeah, you're not slick. You ain't slick. I need to refuel my car first. Okay, okay. Let's refuel it. Let's refuel it. Let's refuel. We refueled it. I refueled the car. Now I can finally drive away. All right. Any, anyone in the car? I don't see anyone in the car. All right. Let's go. Anyone? Well, there obviously is no one in the car. No one? Anyone? Anyone? So are we actually driving home or is this just, just, just a bait? Or maybe this is, maybe I should go on the right side of the road. All right, let's go on the, let's go on the correct side of the road or the American side of the road. This is the wrong side. It's going to get proven. A ghost is just going to come in and just going to be like, what are you doing on the wrong side of the road? Oh, there's whispering in the car. All right, that's great. So I'm going to look. Okay, that was weird. 
I had a long neck and was wearing a suit and tie. But what was that jump scare frame? It just lingered on it for ages. That was driving home. Now, what do I rate that one out of 10? I don't know, man. Uh, I think the driving mechanic was good. I mean, you were just driving. I think I'm going to be rating driving home on the T9 test a 4 out of 10, also known as Ford Fiesta out of 10. As the first random horror games of this year concludes, I don't know. I feel like I'm, I'm I feel like I'm starting to get my mojo back when it comes to making these kind of videos, but it depends on whether you think I'm getting the mojo back when it comes to these kind of videos. So with that being said, thank you guys so much for enjoying another video of mine. But anyway, all the links to the games are in the description, and I know I keep forgetting. I really do keep forgetting, but if there's no game in the description, you got to tell me, man. No one tells me. And then I go back to the comment section or the description and I'm like, oh, darn it, I forgot. Maybe I'll do it next time. And then it's too late. You can't play the game. Although I know a lot of you guys probably don't want to play the game because I just played it for you. But you can get another ending because I know some of these games have multiple endings. So with that being said, uh, links to the games are in the description down below. Use code theft for 10% off gamer subs or code T9 if you want to. But as long as you use it and you show me, I will give you a big hug. I will bear hug you. I will hug you with my fist. I, was, I don't know where that one came from. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this video. And for those of you guys who are watching on the second channel, which is all of you, since this is a pre-recorded video, comment down below what kind of games you want to see me try next. And I'll see you guys in another video.